Okay, hello folks here, how are you? I hope you are fine. Well, today we are going to check pages 28, 29, 30 from the, and 30 from the activity book. Um, I'm recording at night, so maybe uh, tomorrow if that your video, your video will be in the Google Classroom, will be sunny and hot. I haven't seen the weather forecast, so I don't know. Yes, um, it's Thursday, the 7th of May. Yes, you know, I am recording the day before, at night, and you know, because I have many courses, you know. 50, today 50, 51, 52, 53, and 56 from the class book, okay? Um, the homework page is 32, exercise 1, 33, 1, 2, and 3, 34, 1, and 2, and page 35. From the class book, from page 53, you have to write a letter, exercise 5, you have to send it to the Google Classroom, Yes, ojo, PDF, tu nombre, más your name, okay, good, all right, now we go, well, uh, I have to congratulate uh, you, Paula, because your video, your story was very nice, I have already uh, written you um, a message, a private message there, but it is full of connectors, it is full of um, phrasal verbs, it is, uh, the plot is very well organized. Uh, you are not reading, you are telling the story, yes, in a normal way, normally, talking, yes, and it's a hundred percent. Congratulations, I'm very proud. And what happened with the other people? Remember, if you are having problems with their connectivity or something, write to me teacher I, I am having problems with the connectivity or but you know you have many days for sending it don't leave it everything for the last moment yes okay um well the other people who are not appearing in the google classroom activities okay appear again please yes okay because you are going to lose your way yes if you don't do um the exercises i ask yes they are prepared for us to um, uh, evaluate the oral, yes, and everything, okay? Well, so I want you to check, um, I can send more mistakes from the video because uh, this, your video didn't have mistakes, so, um, well, okay, let's go to the correction of pages 20, I will share it, yes, okay, I have many videos for sharing, Many because I ask for your permission in general, yes. And well, but the thing is, I didn't have time yet for sharing, yes. But I will, yes. Okay. I asked David to do, but I haven't seen. I have. I haven't seen if he has posted some of them. Okay. Good. Well, I want you to go to page twenty-eight. Are you there? So we're going to check that page. Yes. Wait a minute. Remember you will have the review on unit four next class. Yes, so here we have to add the note. Yes, okay. I was reading my plan, yes, nota. Yes. Unit four, okay? Okay, it's on the 12th yes, of May. Yes, all right, is it clear? The bomb on a cloud. Okay, good. Noted, yes. Good. Well, so let's go, uh, 28. There, 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 there we go. All right. Param, pa, pa. Okay. So we have number one, jobs. Number two, working. Number three, work. Number four, jobs. Number five, work. Number six, job. Number seven, work. And number eight, job. Yes, okay. Um, 
then we have 29, page 29, you have exercise 4, will, 2, want, 3, will, 4, certainly, also, definitely, 5, certainly, also can also be there, definitely, okay? <clears throat> Good, number 5, probably, 2, could also, may or might, yes, number 3, could, may or might, 4, may, also might, number 5, could, also may or might, yes, when you are not sure, okay? Number uh, 6, 1A, 2B, 3A, 4B, 5B, 6A, all right? Yes, good. Uh, let's go to 30, yes, 1 and 2. Leave school, stay on at school, pass an exam, resist an exam, go to university, become an ap apprentice, get a degree, drop out of college. Yes, okay, good, there we are. I want you to put the date on the pages, this is done, okay. All the pages, 50, 51, 52, 53 and 56, yes. Okay, the date, 50, 51, 53 and 56, yes. for me please I'm checking apprentice 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 yes I was checking that pronunciation, yes, apprentice, yes, okay, well, let's go to <clears throat> 50, 51, are you there? Okay, yes, put the date, 50, 51, 52, yes, okay, leave it there, you put the date there, and I want you to um, have a look at uh, the picture I have prepared for you, yes, because this is the thing we are going to talk in this unit, Yes, okay, are you there? Well, there we are, come on, ah. can you see? Yes, okay, your perfect job. Yes, your perfect job. Yes, so what do you think it could be your perfect job? Yes, I want you to think about this. Uh, I want you to look at the picture. Yes. It says, a guide to discovering your gifts, following your passions, and loving your work for the rest of your life. Do you agree with this? Do you think that this could be the perfect, uh, your perfect job? Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, if you follow your passions, if you love what you do, yes, if you love your work for the rest of your life, remember, the only way to do great work is to love what you do, yes, okay? There is a phrase that says that, yes, you, we have uh, that sign in the classroom, yes, okay? Um, so, um, what is the perfect job? What must a perfect job have? Yes, a good, uh, a good boss, a good salary. What do you think? 
in what conditions you have to work for uh, make it be the perfect job yes so you have to work in good conditions uh, a good salary a good um, atmosphere yes uh, good co-workers yes okay and uh, would you like to work alone or in a team yes which are the advantages of working alone and of working in a team yes do you think uh, each every team needs a leader are you a leader how many kinds of leaders are there yes in life in general yes um what adjectives do you think will describe or would describe a good leader yes okay so i want you to think about this and think about what the perfect job would be yes uh, a job with a good salary uh, good conditions uh, where would you like to work in an office at home yes okay I want you to think about that and talk because this is the time when we introduce the topic this is the time for talking okay is it clear good well I have more pictures yes okay I want you to use at the top at the bottom in the middle on the right on the left in the foreground in the background okay and describe the picture remember we use present continuous for describing pictures yes for example in the middle I can see a girl a woman She's walking and uh, well, it's a group of people. I think they are co-workers. Yes, she's wearing uh, trousers. Yes, she's carrying a bag and she's having a, she's carrying a, a laptop maybe, or maybe it's a folder, a black folder. Yes, um, she's wearing a shirt. Yes, a golden shirt. Yes, she's wearing glasses too. She looks very happy. Uh, she might be happy because she got the job, yes, okay, they, but the three of them look very happy, yes, uh, he's in a suit, yes, okay, he's wearing a suit, a tie, yes, he's laughing too, yes, both of them are looking at the, the woman in the middle, yes, He's wearing, he's not wearing a suit, but he's wearing a tie. He's, he's also wearing a tie. Um, he has short hair. He's wearing a black belt uh, with trousers, beige trousers. He has got a very beautiful watch. Yes, okay. And I think they work uh, in very good conditions. Maybe they, maybe they work in, a, in an office. Um, in the city of Madrid, I think, yes, maybe they work in a Google office, yes, I don't know, but I want you to think about it and to guess, yes, to talk for some minutes about the picture, yes, right? Look, do you think um, for having a better life, do you think you have to take uh, difficult decisions make sorry make difficult decisions in life for example going abroad to look for better opportunities yes do would you like to do this would you like to travel yes abroad to work abroad yes and never come back again yes or do you prefer to work in your country uh, what do you think do you think uh, it's good to go abroad for a better life, for working uh, in better conditions, yes? Uh, which are the advantages and disadvantages of going abroad, yes? So I want you to think about that, yes? Okay, and talk for some minutes about this. Well, the best job, yes? Okay, so what does it mean, yes? I want you to think about... Uh, He's divided in two, yes? This is my opinion. You have to guess and talk about the picture at home. Yes, but he's divided in two, yes? And on the one, on the right side, yes, uh, he has, you know, uh, all the free time activities, riding, uh, uh, I don't know, taking photographs, maybe traveling, drinking cocktails, yes? All the free time activities. And on the other side, all the things that 
uh, are stressing sometimes, yes, because you have to work, you have to correct, you have to uh, yes, respect timings for corrections, for everything. So uh, on the one side, it is stressing, and on the other side, all the things that you can do uh, to have fun, yes, uh, to share moments with family and everything, okay? Do you find, do you think, do you think that finding uh, the balance between work and, um, and free time is necessary for having a better life? What do you think? Yes, I think yes, I agree with this thing, yes, okay? I think um, human, yes, uh, need to find a balance between work and life. But sometimes it's difficult, yes, because nowadays we have to work a lot because uh, we need to uh, buy many things, we need to buy a cell phone, we need to have connectivity, the best connectivity, um, we need to give our children the best cell phones and everything. But the thing, we, we, that the thing that we forget is that they need love, they need somebody to talk to, yes, and sometimes when we work a lot, we are losing the other part, yes. Yeah? So I think finding a balance between life and work is necessary, okay? Well, okay. Well, um, I want you to think about that, yes. Think about these um, topics, yes, because it's working, the perfect work. Um, the balance you need to find between work and life, if it is difficult or not, yes. Uh, are you a workaholic person? Yes. Okay. Do you think in the future you're going to be a workaholic person? Well, I hope no. Yes. Okay. Um, well, sometimes uh, you want to be professional. Um, when you want to be professional, uh, being professional takes uh, time. Yes. And... Okay, you have to study, you have to see, see many things and everything. So, uh, well, you will see in the future. Yes, okay. How can, I'm on page 50, how can these things improve your opportunities in life? Okay, the place you go to school, the place you live, the career you choose, your family. Okay, so I want you to think about that. Yes, okay. So let's go to, uh, I want you to do exercises two, three, four, Yes, okay, do them. Yes, and we're going to check. Oh, 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 all right. The place you go to school, a good school can help you to get good qualification, make you, uh, ma make you, uh, make good life choices, make good friends. If the school is a good a science, for example, or sport, you are more likely to be interested in sport. Yes, okay. Um, and you know, uh, if you are going, suppose you become a teacher, and if you become a good teacher, you will inspire, inspire your students and guide them. Yes, all the time. Yes, but sometimes uh, if you are not a good professional, yes, uh, it disappears, yes. Uh, nowadays, um, I am seeing that, well, of course, um, teachers must do the F, must make the effort, yes, um, to teach from home. But I'm seeing that they are, they are making, some of them, not all of them, but some of them are doing a little, effort yes um, and students need their need they te their teachers yes okay because they are doing nothing at home and they need to be guided nowadays and I think um, they are losing their times yes so I think like uh, a teacher must uh, help students yes must do something for them to learn yes and um, well you know worried about students and I think not many teachers worried about students nowadays yes okay that's my point of view 
yes, okay, and that's very sad, yes, okay, the place you live, the li living in a city or in a country can affect your choices and your choices and your attitude, the people you meet and the role models you have are affected by where you live in a poor or dangerous place, you are more likely to get involved in crime or have low expect expectations in a wealthy, safe place. The career you choose, this affects your um, wealth, but also how you feel about yourself and others. Yes, this is very important. Your, your career may affect where you live, what sort of lifestyle you have, whether you travel or not, who you meet, Yes, your family, a loving family, usually means you are confident and secure. Imagine you have a family that doesn't support you. Yes, okay. So your personality could be very different from a personality of a person who is always supported by the family, um, loved by the family. So uh, this person could be more, in general, of course, would be more secure, more confident. Yes, okay, um, when he or she has a problem in the future, uh, you will know how to deal with this problem, you will um, have good, uh, you will have good life choices, okay, in general, of course, um, well, okay, well, so parents must provide support, and we as teachers, now that we are in this, uh, uh, we are suffering from this um, virus, you need to be supported, yes, by teachers, yes, and some of them are lost, yes, okay, good, yes, I think the thing is make the effort, because I think everybody nowadays is making the effort, I am making the effort because now it's half past 11 and I still recording classes, yes, and you are making the effort because you are making the effort to sit down. Nobody is controlling you. Yes, you are making the effort. Yes, to see the classes, you have to sit there. And you have many other things that you could be doing. For example, watching Netflix, listening to the music you like. Yes, because now it depends on you. You have to sit there, watch the video and continue learning. Yes. Okay, and it's different, yes, you are more comfortable, yes, because you see the video, you are at home, you are in your bathroom with a cup of tea, a cup of coffee, but you are making the effort, yes, okay, so that's what I say, yes, now is the time where I see, yes, the ones who are going to continue, and they are, they are the ones who are going to be uh, left behind, yes, okay, well, so let's go to exercise two, read the article, Yes, a better life. Yes, and I want you to highlight construction worker on line four, on line six, uh, stalls. Yes, uh, on line 10, 11, 12, uh, prepaid phone cards. 24, online 22, the human energy, 25 present day, yes, and I want you to highlight the chart here in the text, yes, uh, interpret, interpre, no, interpreter, yes, in, in, no, on, yes, on, Yes, okay, it's a very on temperature. No. On temperature. On temperature. Yes, okay. Literacy. Yes. Rate. Yes. Um materialistic. Yes. On temperature. On temperature. On temperature. Yes. On Yes. On temperature. Yes, okay. Well, uh, are you ready? So I will check. Remember to pause the video, do the activities, and then listen to the answers. Okay? Good. A paragraph, uh, paragraph uh, four, higher education, better training. A huge number of private courses in a Chinese factory town, English classes, classes, typing classes, technical classes, 
B, paragraph B. One, two, and three. One, men who have come from country villages. Two, the arrival of the women. Three, every year about 10 million people uh, move to cities, to the cities. Paragraph two and three, factories built by men from villager, villages, clothes shop and shoe shops appear. You see public services, three, human energy, the brave entrepreneur, on tap, on tap, printer. Oh my God! Oh my God! Well, uh, the quick movie builders. Yes, every year about ten million people move to the city. Okay, so million people, million of people, a uh, million people move to the city for uh, a better life, uh, for better conditions, uh, for a better job. Yes. Okay. So it happens here. Two, yes, okay, number three, 1D, 2E, 3A, 4F, 5B, 6G, and 7C. I am with that word, yes? Entrepreneur, yes? Oh my God, yes, okay. Yes, okay. Well, are you there? Okay, number one, false. Number two, remember to pause the video, do the activities, and then listen to the answers. Okay, three false, four false, five true. One false, two true, three false, four false, five true. Yes, okay. Uh, do you think, number five, do you think that the people in the new towns have a better life than they did in their villages? Why? Why not? Okay, I want you to talk about this. What do you think? Yes, okay, if they have a better life than they did in their village. Okay, they will miss the village, they will miss the friends, they will miss their, uh, their houses, their families, their relatives, yes. But I think they will have a better job and then they will have a better life in most of the cases because sometimes um, they go they choose to go uh, to crowded cities and they don't get a job they don't find a place to live uh, they don't get anything uh, on the of the things they have already uh, thought that they would have yes and then they start uh, being uh, begging in the street, yes, uh, they are like this. They finish, they end in the street, yes, homeless. It happens, it happens, okay? Well, uh, I want you to go to um, exercise, um, blah, 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 blah. I want you to highlight only this word, long hours, work long hours in exercise nine, paid holiday, pay rises, salary, flexi time, promotion, overtime, pension scheme. Yes, y después, on exercise 10, I want you to highlight um, the, the words there, because these words are very important for talking about jobs, yes? Clocking, on and off, you know? Marcar tarjeta in a... Um, yes, and when you arrive, you have to clock on, and when you leave, you have to clock off, when you leave your job. Discounts and company products, free language classes, health ins insurance, bonuses, company car, part-time, and wages, okay? Good. And then in exercise 11, we have already talked about the perfect job. Then, in, in the next video, you will talk about uh, the perfect job, which it will be the perfect job, and um, what things must a perfect job have to be perfect, okay? Is it clear? So I want you to go to page 52 and 53, then we're going to finish with 56, Yes, but first of all, we are going there. Job requirements. Yes, okay. And it says assistant researcher, full time position plus benefits. Yes, okay. First, 
uh, initial 12 months contract you will be responsible for, you will have, you will be, send CB and covering letter. You, you, you will write a covering letter, if I am not uh, wrong, yes, in exercise 5 from page 53, it says, Write a covering letter. The covering you have already written a covering letter before, I think. Yes, uh, is the letter that goes um, with your CV. Yes, okay. Write a covering letter to go with your application, with an application for a job you'd like. Follow the layout. You have the laid out there. The example. Yes, okay. Good. Is it clear? Yes? Okay. Well, so let's go there. And um, in exercise one, are you there? Yes? Okay. I want you to do exercise one, two, three, four, five, and six. That's all. Yes? Okay. Now is the time that you post the video. I dictate the answers. But you post the video, do it. Yes? Okay. Quietly. Yes? And then listen to the answers. Okay? Number one. Assist duties, deadline for application, skill and qualification required, personal qualities required. Number one, assisting the research coordinator, managing film production materials, dealing with query, queries. Yes, okay. Good. Um, Queries, 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 yes, okay. Uh, number two, the 15th of June, yes, okay. Wait a minute, okay. Uh, a degree in a relevant subject, preferable one, two years experience uh, in film production, excellent database and research skills. Number four, should be organized and independent, able to meet strict deadline. Okay, deadline. Oh, uh, good at working and under and um, working under pressure. Be prepared because in the future uh, you are going to be under pressure in a job. Yes, you are going to um, have strict deadline yes okay you know for example uh, I put fecha de entrega tal tal y el chico el, 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 um, suppose the person who works with me doesn't come in uh, on time one twice three times okay this person doesn't fit this place, yes, because there are deadlines, yes, there is a timetable, yes, there are dates and hours that they must re respect, that's why you have to get used to doing it, because it will help in the future, because the things in the future, when you have a boss or something like this, you're not going to do what you want, it's what your boss wants, yes, at least you have your own company, but in your own company, you are not going to do what you want. You have to follow rules. You have to uh, respect uh, your clients and everything. Yes, depending on what you are going to do. Okay, good. Well, number two, yes, conscious, conscientious, choose how working, methodolic, method, methodical, and self-confident. Do you think being a methodical person is uh, an advantage or a disadvantage? Yes, I want you to think about this. Yes, conscientious, conscientious, conscientious. Yes, creative, uh, energetic, hardworking, methodical, and self confident. I want you to highlight this adjective and think about that. Yes, okay, which are positive and which are negative. Yes, okay, two, three jobs you know something about. What are the most important requirements? Of those jobs for example um, for being a teacher yes a good teacher you must be energetic for me you must be energetic 
you must be self-confident, you must be methodical, yes, you must be creative, you must be hardworking, uh, you must respect um, a timetable, you must uh, respect the uniform, yes, okay, all the things. I want you to think about this, yes, because when you are going to uh, do the next video, record the next video, I'm going to ask you to think about the best job, and what qualities uh, you must have, yes, for um, uh, for doing this job, for example, okay? Um, well, uh, number four, I want you to listen to two friends, Rudy and Mark, discussing the position in the advert, okay? And answer the questions, all right? Yes, good, there we are. Track 31, Unit 4D. This looks interesting. This assistant researcher job for a TV company. I know. The only thing is the experience. They want two years, but I've only worked part-time for a year, really. One or two years' experience, it says. And anyway, you meet the other requirements. You're good under pressure and with deadlines. You always hand your essays in on time at college. Mm. That's not the same thing. Of course it is. And you're really well organised, hard-working, highly motivated. <laughs> okay, okay, if that's what you think. Is it alright if I give you as my referee? Hmm, mm, I'm not sure about that. I don't think you can just put down your friends' names. I know your essays in on time at college. That's not the same thing. Of course it is. And you're really well organised, hard-working, highly motivated. OK, OK, if that's what you think. Is it alright if I give you... He used to hand in, yes, he used to respect, uh, he used to hand, he was very, uh, he used to um, respect deadlines, yes, at, in the college, yes, because the friend says, OK, he used to hand in everything in advance, yes. He was my referee. On time. Mm, I'm not sure about that. No. The referee es la persona que te da las referencias. You know, you always, you, when you have a CV, uh, you have a referee. And it mustn't be a friend. Yes? I don't think you can just put down your friends' names. I know, shame. But seriously, do you mind helping me with my CV? I need to make it look a bit more professional. Of course not. Are you going to apply for this job then? Yeah, I think I will. But I'll need my CV anyway, whichever job I apply for. OK, print it out and I'll have a look at it. Will you be able to do it today? Yes, I will. But what's the hurry? The closing date for applications is in a couple of days. The closing day, yes. OK, what's the hurry? You have a closing day, yes, as in the activities uh, you do with teacher rule, closing day, no, whenever you want, yes, because everything must be organized for you to have your correction, yes, okay? Oh, can you have a look at my covering letter too? Covering letter. Have you already written it? No, but I'll do it this afternoon and then I can send everything off tonight. Hey, they might ask me to go for an interview this week. Yeah, they might. But I haven't got any smart clothes. Would it be okay to borrow your suit? Sure, no problem. Smart clothes. You haven't got smart clothes because um, the dress code is very important. Okay, the dress code. Do you, do you think so? Okay, good. Well, number five, yes, I want you to look at the... Well, we correct first number four. Okay, yes. Number two, no. Yes, and number three, small, smart clothes, a suit. Yes, okay, let's go to exercise five. And I want you to highlight all the grammar charts there with the requests. Yes, could you give me a lift? Can you have a look at my current letter? Will you be able to do it today? Yes, responding, of course, I'm not sure about that. I will, not sure, yeah, no problem. Yes, okay. Would you like to do a job like the one in the advert? Yes? No? Why? 
Okay? Yes or no? Yes? Are you a responsible person? Yes? Okay. Are you good with that deadline? Yes or not? Yes? Okay. Are you good at organizing? Are you independent? Are you an independent person? Yes? Okay. Um, are you good at working under pressure? Do you think people good well under pressure? Under pressure? Yes? Okay. So I want you to think about that. Yes? Okay. Well, um, I want you to go to exercise page 53, page 53, I want you to go to page uh, exercise 1, 2, 3 and 4, yes, 1, 2, 3 and 4, yes, okay, remember to pause the video, do the activities and then listen to the answers, okay, good. Which do you think is the most common way to apply for a job? SCV? A letter, personal contact, a phone call or an application form? Well, this is your opinion. Yes, okay. Uh, number two. A in paragraph four. Yes, okay. It's, uh, you know, the letter is divided. Yes, I'm going to dictate you this. A in paragraph four. B at the top right on the letter under the sender's address. The date. ¿Vieron dónde va la fecha? Yes, A. Yes, a reference to your CV in, a, in paragraph 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. I enclose my CV which gives you full details of my qualification work. Yes, okay. Um, wait a minute. You have a very nice example there. Okay, and then, well, you have, um, yes, did you know paragraph? Acordate que los párrafos van a estar separados por sangría. Si, ¿Sí? tenés que dejar sangría, escribí. No te olvides de la sangría, no es ni con puntitos, ni con corazones, ni nada. Sangría, la sangría son lo, es lo que va a separar los párrafos. Yes, B. At the top, on the right of the letter, under the sender's address. Yes, at the top, on the right. Yes, okay. There you have the date. Ahí tenés la fecha, 7 July 2017. Yes, okay. Good. Y ahí tenés la fecha, el lugar donde va la carta. Yes, okay. Is it clear? All right. Good. Um, bueno, ahí tenés tú, perdón, tenés la fecha. Yes, tenés la fecha y your address. Acaba tu address, eh. Is it clear? This is your address. And this is the person who you are writing to. Yes. Remember, uh, if you know the, the, the person of, the, uh, of who you are writing to, you will finish your letter with yours sincerely. If you don't know the name, if you put dear sir or dear mother, you will finish the letter with your, with your faithfully. Remember, your sincerely when you know the, the, um, the person's name. And if you don't know, your faithfully. Okay? Is it clear? Good. So, there we are. Uh, 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 uh. So, I, uh, then we have uh, C. At the top left below the sender's address and the date. Yes, this is C, the name and address to the person you are writing to. D, in paragraph one. D, the reason for your letter. I am writing in reply to your advertisement in the daily hair for the position. Acordate que siempre tenés que poner for the position of. Yes, because this is the one you want to apply. Assistant, teacher, yes. Okay. E, your address. Yes, F, yes, in uh, 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 your interest in the position, F, yes, in paragraph one, I will graduate, I have experience in my ta 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 production, I have work, yes, blah blah blah, okay, G, yes, in paragraph four, G, your phone number, yes, 
one, two, three, four. I close my CV and then you have the contact details. Yes, okay? In your CV. Of course, I in paragraph one, two, and four, I, your re relevant experience, paragraph two, yes, one and four, J in paragraph two and four, yes, your skills, yes, I am available for interview at any time, yes, I'm willing to relocate if necessary, yes, and then you have um, responsive, you are responsible for planning, schedules, uh, program achieve, achieving, yes, okay, good, and well, in an email you don't need to include your address, or that of a person you are writing to. Two, you also don't need to include the date as uh, this will already feature as part of the email header. Acordate, vos tenés el, el, ¿cómo es? el CV, yes? but you always have to write enclose this letter, yes? You have to enclose uh, this letter in your CV, okay? Right? Is it clear? Well, um, let's go to exercise um, three. No, three is not necessary. Okay, three is not necessary. Wait, wait, wait. Yes, okay, we can close it out. Yes, okay. And exercise four. Yes, okay. Remember, it's a formal style, yes? Remember, it's a formal style, yes? I will graduate, yes? Formal phrases, I am writing to reply. I consider myself as, yes? I consider mas myself to be, yes? You don't have to use contractions. Acordate, no se usa contractions. Don't use contractions, no contractions there. Yes, okay, standard phrases to open and close the letter. Yes, dear, eso es lo que te dije recién, you're sincerely, you're faithfully, okay? Entonces, eso es para tener en cuenta la carta que vas a escribir. Five, write a covering letter to go with an application for a job you would like to, for a job you would like to, okay? Is it clear? Okay, you have to choose the job, imagine the job, and you have to write an application letter, yes? And this is the guide, yes? Okay, is it clear? All right, remember, don't use contractions. Wanna, I wanna go, yes, okay? Um, the formal, uh, be formal, because it's a very formal style. And now I want you to go to page 56, and that would be all for today. Yes, the revision 56, okay? Are you there? Yes, okay. I want you to do exercise one, okay? Do exercise one, yes? Um, number two, yes? Number three, number five, number six, and number seven, okay? I will dictate the answers now. But this is the time where you pause the video and then listen to the answers, okay? Number one, remember the use of um, will, going to, present continuous, and um, present simple as future, yes? Study the uses. Remember, when you are not sure, you will use might or may, yes? Okay, number one, will. Number two, going. Number three, I'm. Number four, will. Number five, two. Number six, will. Number seven, not. Number eight, might or could. Number nine, won't. And number ten, getting. Yes, I'm getting a takeaway for dinner tonight. This is a decision you make at the moment. Yes. Okay. Two. Yes. Okay. Which comments in exercise one do you think the students in the photo above might make? Why? Blah, blah, blah. Yes, what comments? Yes, they, they might make there. Okay, this is for you. Okay. Um, number three. Yes, okay. Good. Plans. Acordate. Plans, predicciones, predictions. Okay, plans. I'm going to change jobs soon. Two. 
I'm five. I'm going to be the best chef, chef in the country one day. So these are plans. Going to. Acordate, um, native speakers tend to use the short form, will. I go, I'm meeting my best friend tonight. Yes, or using this, the present continuous. Okay, uh, and it's not very common that they use, I'm going to. Yes, okay, predictions. I'm sure nobody will be able to eat this. Four, this will be definitely, this will definitely, this, this will definitely impress the dinner. Six, my parents will be so proud of me. Seven, this might not turn out as I expected. May, may not, when you're not sure. Wow, my hat might or could catch fire in this kitchen. Nine, my friends won't believe, won't believe me when I tell them about my day. Yes, okay, good. Well, uh, exercise four. Yes, okay, uh, you have, no, four, no, five, exercise five. Well, remember the exercise four? Uh, make predictions about the future with, with, will, show different degrees of certainty, predictions with may, might, or could, yes, ask and answer questions about future plans, Arrangement, going to and present continue. For that, the future plan and arrangement, you will use going to or present continuous. Okay? Exercise 5. 1 E, 2 A, 3 D, 4 C, and 5 B. Yes? Okay? Exercise 6. Okay? Uh, this is for talking at home about uh, the qualities and qualifications you need and the pay conditions yes say which job could be best for you yes and you have to give reasons why yes are you qualified for being well, there so remember you have to study this is the, um, the homework remember you have to study for revision and remember to see page 162 page 162 that is the grammar reference the uses, because I, I know that you know how to form may, might, will, going to, present simple, present continuous as future. But the thing is that you need to study the uses, yes? We use will, may or might to make predictions. Will, won't, when we are confident about a prediction, yes? Uh, I will definitely go to your party, to your wedding party, yes? Probably definitely we use may or might yes when we are less confident when we are not sure yes then we have the future form yes present continuous when it is a fixed arrangement to do something yes okay a fix i am meeting my husband at seven this afternoon yes this is fixed i have a schedule yes okay will yes okay for the decision made at the moment i will go don't worry i will take you going to at the moment of speaking going to uh what is a plan yes i'm going to travel to miami in two years yes i am paying for it yes i i have decided before the moment of speaking and then present simple yes for an event that follows regular schedule or timetable the train leaves at 7.40. Yes, it's clear? Okay, well, that's all. See you next class. Study. Bye-bye for here.